to me, I'm worth it. Baby, I'm worth it. Also, I am back. I was feeling a little bit um sick lately, so but I am back as you guys can see, and I finally got my green hair, y'all. Alright, so <laughs> let me stop being damn dramatic. Alright, so let me go ahead and get into the specs of this unit because I know you guys are like, oh baby. Alright, so <laughs> this is the Bobby Boss wig and I have her in M899YV trim. I have her in a TT. I'm 1B green that I have on right now. And I also have her in this color, the 99J slash purple. And this is what that unit looks like on the model. And I'll go ahead and show her to you in one second. But let me go ahead and get into the construction of this cap. Like I said, this is a full cap unit, so there is no lace to cut. There are no combs in the unit, just adjustable straps. And I'll go ahead and show that to you now. Um, it's going to be a pretty standard cap construction. Except for with this full cap unit, you get parting space, as you can see. And here is the cap construction for this wig. Like I said, there are just adjustable straps, no combs. And your parting space is pretty, it goes back pretty thick. I mean, pretty deep. So, you probably get about a good three inches with this. And my only gripe about um, with it, that, you know, with it having that little bit of lace parting right there. Look at that. I don't like that. But that can be fixed, so I'm not, you know, going to complain too much. And as you can see, the purple is really, really gorgeous. And the density on this unit is pretty good, as you can see. So let's go ahead and get into the specs. Well, I'm going to go ahead and, you know, do like a little 360 for you guys. So here is your left side. Here's your right side. And here's all the hair to the back of the unit. And she's probably about a good, I want to say, um, 20 inches long. So she's a, she's not going to be a shorter unit, but she is very, very full. And when I say she's full, she is full. As you guys can see, I am just fluffing her out. And you see all that hair? Oh my goodness. So... Definitely not a summertime unit, but <laughs> um, you can probably get away with it if it's cooler. So, yeah. This unit is so gorgeous. And the curls on this unit, they're very free-flowing. And the um, what I want to say about the texture of this unit, as you can see, it's not a silky texture. It has like a yakky type texture to her. Um, so yeah, oh my goodness, I love this unit. I'm so happy I finally got a green unit, and it just makes me, uh, it's, it's just gorgeous. I love the shade of green. It's not, um, like a blue-green, it's a true green. So let me go ahead and put on the purple so I can show you guys what that color looks like on me, and I will be right back. Hold on one moment for me. Alright, and here is your purple option. Now you see your purple option is really gorgeous and it does look like the model when it's styled in the middle. Um, however, I don't really like the middle part for this unit because I think the parting is a little too bulky. As you can see, I don't I don't know. Well at the tip of it it's a little too bulky. I'm probably gonna go ahead and try to open it up with just a little bit more and do it from there, but for some reason, the purple is a lot more easier to tame than my green unit because I can actually style this one without an issue. Because with my green, um, my green color option, the curls they are not as ruly <laughs> as it is showing here on the purple. And as you can see, this purple, um, what I like what they did with the rooting, it's not a black. It is a 99J, subtle 99J. And then as you can see, it gradually goes into this purple and it's um this purple is not going to be your bright purple it's going to be your um grayish lavender purple which i do love and uh yeah so i purchased this unit from ebonyline.com she is available on um sam's beauty as well but sam's beauty didn't have the, these colors that I'm reviewing right now so I had to order from ebonyline.com and just tips for ordering from Ebony, Ebony Line 
what you want to do is call their customer service before you order and see if they actually have the unit in stock because a lot of times it while it is showing in stock they may not actually have it in stock and they'll still allow you to buy it so just you know if you're if you do purchase from ebony line go ahead and call them before you place your order that way you're not stuck in limbo waiting for your order to get there because they don't have it in stock so yeah this is my review for miss um why Vitra? Let me know how you ladies like her and I will come at you guys later with another review. Bye.